Hello friends, my name is Parish and what you see on your screen is Dynamic Snap. Now we are going to look into the journal journals and how to use them to book into the GL. So we have a situation where the owners of this company have decided to uh, put in some $10,000 of equity into the bank account. Now in order to record this transaction, we, need, we will be using the journal journals. So let's just type in the journal journals over here and select it. Now once the journal journal is open, the first thing that you need to do is select a posting date. I will leave it as it is, which is the working date right now. And we can choose the account type as GL account. And in account now, drill down on the accounts and choose your equity account. Now over here you see that the document number is provided by the system and that is because in the batch we have specified the number series for this batch. If you do not provide the number series you can manually um, provide that yourself or if you want the system to provide it just use the number series over here and the document number will be provided by the system automatically. Now. Um, since it's a cash deposit entry of the bank account, so you should select a bank account as the balancing account. So you should not uh, book it directly to the GL. Um, it is because, you know, the two might be out of sync. So um, we need this particular debit increase uh, on the bank account to be registered both on the bank account card and in the GL account. So we'll choose our bank account, let's say map over here. So we have the equity account over here and we have the bank account as balancing account over here. And we'll select the amount, which is $10,000. So this particular amount will be debited from the bank account and credited to the equity account. Now, since it's a credit to the equity account, uh, it will be negative over here. And as you can see over here, the total balance is zero. So it is good to post. So what we are going to do is click on post and the journal line was successfully posted. Okay, now let us go and check the entries that are created. Uh, let us go to our chart of accounts. And as you can see over here, there are some transactions in the equity account. And if we go to our bank account card, over here you can see that since we chose to post on the bank account, we have entries on the bank account card over here as well. And if you navigate it further, you will see that for this particular transaction, there were two entries, GL entries created. One is to the equity account and one is to the GL account 2920, which is the bank account in the GL account. And the other one was the bank account ledger entry since we chose to post to the bank account card. 